Loop diuretics are the most powerful class of diuretics. The main drugs in this class are sulfonamide derivatives. Loop diuretics action is described as a torrential urine flow. Loop diuretics act on the thick ascending limb of the loop of Henle. The thick ascending limb is the main site for active sodium reabsorption. On the luminal membrane, the transporters involved are the sodium potassium chloride cotransporter and potassium channels. On the bastolateral membrane, the transporters involved are the sodium potassium ATPase potassium channels, the potassium chloride cotransporter, and chloride channels. The sodium potassium ATPase drives active sodium reabsorption by moving free sodiums across the basolateral membrane into the interstitium in exchange for two potassium ions. Potassium is returned to the interstitium through the potassium channel and the potassium chloride cotransporter. This creates a deficit of sodium inside the epithelial cell. The sodium potassium chloride cotransporter is activated to restore this deficit. The cotransporter NKCC2 moves one sodium, one potassium and two chloride from the lumen into the nephron wall. Potassium goes back to the lumen through the potassium channel. Chloride moves to the interstitium through the chloride channel and the potassium chloride cotransporter. Loop diuretics block the sodium potassium chloride cotransporter. This prevents sodium and chloride cotransport across the luminal membrane. The reabsorption of sodium and chloride in the thick ascending limb is blocked. The result is greater excretion of sodium, chloride and potassium in the filtrate and their reduced levels in the blood. 